Wait is almost over for Purdue's Sweet 16 meeting with Tennessee. The Boilers were up early for practice this morning in Louisville. Tonight, our Megan McEwen continues Purdue's postseason coverage on Wish TV. The Boilers are back in the Sweet 16 for the third straight year. Purdue destroyed anything and everything in its way en route to Louisville, beating both first round teams by an average of 20 points. In their way, a Tennessee team who has five players that average double figures. And the Golden Black haven't been to the Elite Eight in 19 years. It'd be special, and I think uh, we talked about it at the beginning of the season as you know, we want to you know, make that run. I think that's everybody's goal around the whole NCAA is um, obviously win your conference, but then once you get to that tournament and you can get in the tournament, uh, make that run. It'd be very satisfying, you know. Um, a lot of people have said, you know, um, how do you get over this hump? You know, there, there's no real secret. You just got to go out there and compete and have fun. That'd be cool, but for the most part, we're just focusing on this game right now. But it would be cool to advance, but we we play one of the best teams in the country first, so that's a that's a tall task for us first that we're working working and focusing on. We've shown toughness to be able to get there. Um, obviously, the people that are they're standing there waiting for you are pretty good, you know, pretty good teams. Um, so I don't think it's anything different. I, I think you just have to be better at what you already do. Uh, you're not going to reinvent the wheel after 35 games and play differently. You know, you've got to keep playing the same way. Um, you just got to be a little bit better. I think we've ran into a couple bus saws um, in, in a couple of those sweet 16s and a couple other ones. We were right there. We just didn't, you know, get the job done. Boiler head coach Matt Painter is 0-4 in Sweet 16 games. However, the key to getting this Purdue team going, guard Carson Edwards. When Edwards scores 20 or more points, the Boilers are 19-6. and The question remains, how is he going to follow up a 42-point performance? We find out tomorrow. At the KFC Yum Center in Louisville, Megan McEwen, Wish TV News 8.